You, you're just laughing to yourself now. <laughs> Strange man. Drugs. All right. Uh, it's got to be. No, no. mood stabilizers. <laughs> Legal prescribed mood stabilizers, Pender. You turn that into a bong again and you're out. <laughs> no, stop. <laughs> That'll be a standards problem. <laughs> I want that out! <laughs> We're gonna hear from the standards lady, aren't we? That's all, come out of the show! <laughs> no, it won't, because I will... Well, if they want it out, it's out. Um, <laughs> Bring that camera in real tight. Real tight. Real tight. Real tight. Real tight. Real tight. <laughs> Booby. <laughs> By the way, when our show goes high def, I will not be pulling the camera in that close again. <laughs> Ow. Uh, Hey, it's time to do something now we've always enjoyed doing on this show. It's always a good time. The writers here love it. It's a, something we call If They Mated. Let me explain. Let me explain how this works. We have this amazing machine here that NASA developed that can uh, take, uh, take, follow me here, celebrity couples, couples that are dating, and look into the future and see what would happen if they had a child. What would that child look like. Hence the term, if they made it. It's caused us a lot of legal problems, but we continue to do it. Uh, let's start right now. For example, uh, this is a hot, hot young couple, Drew Barrymore and Fabrizio Moretti. That's right. They've been going out uh, for a while now. Of course, he's from The Strokes. Uh, the rumors are that they are shopping for rings and that this could be serious. So we thought, what would happen if Drew and Fabrizio had a child? What would it look like? Let's take a look right now and find out. And <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> kind of a Frank Zappa thing, but also a Larry Fine from the Stooges. <laughs> and then some bruising for some reason. <laughs> Possibly picked on by the other children. Hard to know. Uh, this is a uh, hot, talk about a good looking cuppy. Nio uh, cu what'd I say? <laughs> Did I say what? I said good looking guppy? <laughs> wow. Um, let's just not even air this show tonight. <laughs> let's just show an old happy days instead. <laughs> People will think Richie Cunningham is me and they won't notice. <laughs> I'm back on board now. Here I am. Naomi Campbell and Adrian Brody. Naomi Campbell and Adrian Brody have been seen together at her birthday party canoodling. Canoodling is the tabloid term for sort of nuzzling, necking, and making noodles. So uh, <laughs> let's see what would happen if... Naomi Campbell and Adrian Brody had a child. Let's take a look right now, and... <laughs> See that one more time? That's incredible. That's not even... I don't know what that is, but they've been plaguing farmers for centuries. <laughs> they tunnel, they destroy the roots, and then you've got nothing. This is crazy, but apparently, according to the tabloids, and we're allowed legally to use the tabloids, according to the tabloids, according to the tabloids, Nicole Kidman is going out with Fox News Channel's Shepard Smith. Nicole Kidman, and from Fox News, Shepard Smith, these two have been seen together, they're dating. Let's find out what would happen if they had a child. I'm just curious. <laughs> Oh my God. If the people of Earth do not meet my demands, put it back. The United Nations has one hour. Or I'll melt the polar ice caps. Wow. No, that was unfair. I apologize, apologize to Guppy. What's happening? I do think I need coffee or something out here. I don't know what it is. It's, you know, it's so late. It's almost one, and so I get... Tired. <laughs> it's late. Very late. Get me some coffee. Jeff, can you phone someone? How do I get coffee? Can I get coffee, please? 
This is the director I'm calling. Can I get coffee in here? Because I'm just, I'm not tracking right now. Something's off and the audience is sensing it and we'll lose them. <laughs> and then what kind of lead is that for Carson Daly? <laughs> Have you heard about this? Because Star Jones from The View has done nothing else but talk about her fiance, Al Reynolds, and how they're getting, they're engaged and they're gonna get married and she has a website and that's all she talks about. She wants the whole world to know that she's engaged, she's getting married, so let's find out what their child would look like. I wanna see right now. <laughs> was quick. Mm. Mm. Uh, that is, that's iced coffee. Prop coffee? Prop coffee they get me. What's this? Is this real coffee? Yeah, this is real. What is this then? What's prop coffee? Who are you? <laughs> that's a guy from the audience. A guy in the audience just grabbed a headset that he brought with him and put it on. By the way, all anyone has to do in the audience is put on a headset and run down here and you'll probably get a check. Uh, <laughs> That, that is cold, huh? Crazy. Anyway, where were we? Oh, right, if they made it. And then the last one with, ha ha, Star Jones. <laughs> Finally. Here's one that's a little odd. Bear with me. Okay, The Simple Life is back on the air. That show, The Simple Life. So we thought we should take a look at what would happen if sex-starved socialite Paris Hilton hooked up with one of the many hillbillies she encounters while filming this show. What if, you know, she's always meeting these people, so what if, what if Paris Hilton Sex starved Paris Hilton hooked up with a hillbilly. What kind of child would they have? Let's take a look right now and uh. <laughs> Booby. All right. We'll take a little break. We got a fine show tonight when we come back. Ashley Judge here.